Trade would be better facilitated if the federal government consistently drives an effective multimodal transport system in Nigeria. The leadership of the Bridge Operators Association of Nigeria indicated a position while underscoring the importance of a robust barge operation to the country's logistics value chain. TVC News correspondent Ifunaya Eze reports. As the world readjusts itself to what is now known as a new normal, following the coronavirus global crisis and the attendant downturn, countries across the globe are grappling with sustaining their economic viability and keeping afloat. Nigeria is not excluded as it focuses its attention on trade while strategizing on how to make the country more marketable. The leadership of barge operators in Nigeria is of the view that considering the deficits in infrastructure, especially the roads, badges should be deployed in more cargo evacuation. It costs less to transport a container or some cargo from China to Lagos than from Lagos to the hinterlands because of the infrastructural deficit that we have in the economy today. By extension of the barging service to the hinterlands, it will therefore reduce the cost of moving cargo down to the final destination. And by extension, once you're able to do that, it reduces the cost of the cargo down to you reduce the, the, the price of the cargo that the final consumer will eventually have to pay. When you look at the ripple effect that this will have in, in present day Nigeria today, where we are faced by a very challenging economic situation, it is therefore very important for us to bring down cost of production. He argues that evacuating cargoes through badges would also ease congestion on the port corridor and resolve recurring problems associated with returning of empty containers. Before the advent of badges, importers were able to pick out their containers, but always found it very difficult to return their containers back to the port. As a result of which, the demoret boarding was placed on the importers, on the clearing agents and on the transporters. We want to see barging being extended further to the um, more distant parts of the country. There's no reason why you cannot put heavy cargo on barges from Lagos all the way down to Wari or to Port Harcourt or to Lokoja. This will take a lot of collaborative effort from the various stakeholders to make it happen. Currently, an average of 2,500 containers are being transported on barges daily to the various terminals across Lagos. Ifunanya Eze, TVC News, Lagos.